Alright. Well, y'all know what this video is about. A lot of y'all seen it online. All that. After this video, I'm going to let it go. Everybody's going to think what they're going to think. But I can lay the proof at, at your feet. And I get what a few are saying. I get it. But the thing is, is when I was showing the measurements, they don't want to talk when my hands was off the tape and it was nowhere near it and it showed my measurement in the same picture that I sent to and he wrote me and he said yeah it's 26 okay it's 26 all right and I said dude you know I was really squeezing that thing I said it was bigger than 26 he got and he got he changed he he was fire with me he changed it he gave me 26 and 3 8 and it still put me an ounce under the leader all right i'm still beat that's cool i can take a loss you know and plus he was far enough to say to see that i was squeezing the tape he obviously seen it or he wouldn't have changed my my weight he wouldn't have did that for me if he didn't think i was right obviously but anyway he changes my weight i'm one ounce under the winner i'm 38 one he's 38 two all right I said, well, thinking to myself, because it's competitive, this is what we do. I race these. If I don't think you're right, I'm going to tear you down. We're going to see. We're going to see what you got. If I think you cheated me and I really won, to be fair, yeah, we're going to see what you got. So I said, hey, I'm going to see this guy's video. If I see one thing in the video that don't look right, we've got the win. That, that's, that's the only way we can do it. But if he's perfect, we're beat. That's okay. I, I would expect somebody to do it to me, and they they have. So, with that being said, <clears throat> this guy has this tape. Let me just. I had to get my tape. All right, so we got 20, 26 inches. All right. That's pretty much what both of ours was supposed to have been. So 26 inches, line to line. All right. So, mine's on 26. If you'll look at the screenshot, I slow motioned his video when the tape was tight. It was like, maybe 25 and a quarter 25 and a half I got the screenshots I'll post them in the end of the video you tell me but the whole thing was is that after how do you get 27 out of 25 and a half that don't, that don't I mean you can tell he slipped it that much he's like you can see it was tight and he's like oh, oh and he's, he's you can see the whole stutter in the video when you watch it you can see it you can see it happen if you play it in slow motion and even if you watch it in full speed you can see what it does it goes 25 and a half i zoom it in and run it on slow motion you gotta zoom it in let's see slips the tape all right and then on mine got 26 and i'm holding it with my fingers trying to show you if you've got a fish this big around and you wrap the tape around it, all right, you got a fish this big around, he's going to wrinkle up. There's going to be some slack in there unless you just absolutely wrap it around it and choke him. And in a tournament, there ain't nobody going to cut off an inch and a half, two inches of their own fish by squeezing it in their fat. This is, you just think you're not going to, so don't give me that. Ain't going to happen. The next thing is, is the guy that won the flathead tournament, and and I hate to even bring this up, I hate to even bring this up, but it, it's just another way to show you that they was out for bent rods. They was out to make sure we didn't win, whether we won or not. The only way we could have legitly won is if we'd have beat their fish by 10 or 20 pounds, something very obvious. And then they would have probably still tried to say something was crazy with the measurement or whatever they could have said. There ain't no telling, because you can just tell they had it out for bent rods. Bent rods wasn't winning that tournament. We lost it before we left the house. But like I said, I hate to bring these guys up, and congratulations on the win, by the way. I don't want to see nobody lose. But the guys that won the flathead tournament, 
I'll post his screenshot in the end too, proven. He says wrote him and was fussing to him because to be honest, on his video, you couldn't see the numbers. You couldn't see nothing. You don't, you, nobody knew. I mean, nobody else in the tournament knew. I'm not saying the guy's a liar, but you know, somebody that's wanting to be fire and it's really, that really does this, wanting to win that money, we're not gonna come to play games. We wanna see the measurement and we wanna see it up close. Just like I gave it to him. So with me having my phone right on the measuring tape, you think I you think that I'm gonna have slack in it on purpose and you think that I'm gonna have it messed up on purpose to get disqualified? Get real. Get real. But you know what? The only thing we didn't get out of the tournament is the money. Because, to be honest, I won. I know I won. It's obvious I won. I'm going to prove it on the video. Y'all are going to see it, have seen it. There ain't another way that I can that I can point it out to you and to show you how I didn't win. So it is what it is. It, you can believe what you want to believe. This is the last I'm going to say about it. <clears throat> There's another thing about it. All my fish that I catch, it's recorded. From the time that fish takes it down to the time that I reel it in and to the time I show it off for my YouTube videos and then end it to measure it, to send it back to the, the guy that did the tournament. It's not much matter what you show him, he'll make it what he wants. Uh, but there ain't none of them other guys doing that. And I ain't knocking nobody, but I'm just saying I'm probably the most legit that does this. I really am. I mean, I prove it from, from the time it begins to the time it ends. There can't nobody say that I got my fish off a fellow fisherman on the bank or that I waved a boat over and they gave me a fish off their boat to measure and let go or whatever. There can't nobody ever say I cheated. I come correct 100% every time. I don't have no reason to cheat. That's why... I'm so upset about this is because I am so fair and I fuss about being fair. Because the first time they said that they disqualified me because I complained too much, and I do. I catch many things that they do wrong that's against their rules and they allow it to slide and it's beating people like me which could win if they didn't do this. So yeah, I complain. So, think what you want to. It is what it is, I've said enough. Bent rods over and out. Hope y'all enjoy the video.
Bookie, Bookie. Yeah. Bookie, I gotta turn my winner on, man. Oh my God, help me get him, Bookie. Bookie, help me get him. Yeah, 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 baby, yeah, Bucky, we did it, dog, we did it. Oh, yeah, we can if we fall. Yeah, baby, let's go, Bit Rise, baby, let's go. Yes. Oh, yeah. You look at what a fish bent rods, baby. Let's go. Did y'all see that? What a takedown! What a nice, nice takedown. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah, we can show them out him. Look what a fish! Look what a fish! Rah, bent rods, baby. Let's go. Yes. Yeah, baby. All righty, guys, I'm gonna hop off here so I can sign this fish in. Been a long morning. We're on this bank fishing tournament. I gotta go ahead and get this fish uh, uh, signed in, or uh, whatever, I can't even talk. I'm so tired and happy and everything all at once. <clears throat> Let me measure this fish out, guys. I go ahead and hit stop on her. This is Jared Wise, bank fishing catfish tournaments, number 978. This is Jared Wise, Bent Rod Expeditions. All right, get a close up right here. My line on his nose at the very tip. All right, come down the measuring tape. Down, down, down. And we have got... Let's see. Right. We have got 44 inches at the very tip. Can you see? The very tip right here, 44 inches. 44 inches long. Girth is twenty six inches girth right here get this line real close bookie that way they can see I'm very particular about being fire 
he's almost 26 and a half but he's a little more than 26 but we'll say 26 26 girth This massive blue right here. Alrighty. All right, stop that video. You recorded. Huh? All right, got the video. This is the release of that blue. What was he, 44 inches long? What was it, 26 around, I think? I don't know, that might be wrong. Don't pay attention to that. Just watch the video. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna release him. He's a house. Don't go under the bank. On there he goes. There he goes. Big old boy going back. Big old boy going back. Nice bit rod, baby. Let's go. Look at me. I'm covered in catfish. Hey, woo, bit rod, baby. Let's go. I'll have to, when I get this on here, get to show that it's at the nose. Oh, over three feet. Forty two. Okay. Got him. 